What's up guys, today is Thursday. That means it's, well, y'all know what day it is. This big old gigantic Mack truck is here. So let's take a look and see what Mack Daddy's got. You guys, come on. Look at all them names, a bunch of them. So how many has sold so far? 90. 90. One week, 90 names, 90 tickets already been sold. Holy cow. I know from some of the comments, folks saying, oh, it won't sell out. They won't ever give it away because it won't sell. Well, <laughs> one week we're at 90 people. And y'all still got two months to go pretty much in mm -hmm. the May or May 29th so and, uh, I don't think 150 is gonna be hard to sell out at all not by the looks of it so there you go guys if y'all want in somebody could start with 91 but that's all the holes I got left to fill now did your wife write that or did you write that it dang sure isn't my writing. Because <laughs> it's very legible. So. <laughs> you won't be able to read it if I wrote it. Man, that's good. That's a lot of names. It, uh, my phone went crazy last Thursday. I know you told me it Friday, sounded like a Saturday. slot machine yeah. going off. So, that's good though. I mean, yeah. It's a heck of an opportunity for somebody to get a really nice box. Yep. That's a lot of names up there. Yeah, it'll definitely, it'll definitely go then. What are y'all gonna do if y'all get it out before then? Y'all gonna come up with something different, maybe? We've talked about it, we'll just have to see how it goes, so. Well, I don't think that, I think the Titan's leaving. I think so. I'm looking forward to that day. Uh, one thing I did get in is some of the RBRT. Ooh, the, yeah. uh, where's it at? The socket extractors, I guess you'd call them. I got in some of the it's not often you need SAE stuff anymore but from time to time yeah when you need it you need it I just got this set in got a couple of those in I think they were in the flyer mm -hmm. time before yeah. last maybe but and, uh, what is that, 11 sixteenths down to a 7 sixteenths or something? Well, that's I, good. I had a couple of people that had been asking for some standard ones, so some equipment guys, and I ordered some in for them and ordered a couple for the truck. You going to have any of the, I know they're supposed to be coming out with like the quarter inch socket extractors and all that, when they supposed to have them? I've like, got them on order. I've not gotten a date when I'm supposed to actually receive them, but I do have them on order. Those will come in handy right there. Mm -hmm. Those smaller sizes. Uh, like, I like it because they got the deeps too now, so yep. that's going to save some headaches going down the road. Yeah, we got a big RBRT order coming in for uh, the meetup. So. That's good. I know Dan's going to be here at the meetup and kind of demo some of the stuff and be able to answer anybody and everybody's questions that they may have or show them how to use them or talk mm -hmm. to them about the ways they can use them and all that. So it's going to be a good, good little meetup, you know, a lot of fun stuff. I know there's a lot of people excited about coming and getting on this truck. And... Just, I mean, several of my customers that I have, um, I know that follow the channel. I've been telling them, but I'm like, oh, that's cool. You know, yeah. they said, we'll try to come up. So that's what I told everybody. I said, bring a pocket full of money. <laughs> yeah. If you don't, you're going to be sad if you sad if you don't, because when you get there, they're going to have plenty of stuff to plenty of stuff to buy and look at mm -hmm. and all that stuff. So. Brake pad gauge. That's something you don't see very often. Instead of the ones that flip out and you can't mm -hmm. wedge the whole thing in there. That's pretty nice right there. 
you know when most people bring their brakes in here it's squealing so bad there ain't no doubt it needs to be replaced <laughs> that's how it works here like they can't do it before it runs the rotor gotta wait till you get the good grind going yeah and then they want to be like man what do you mean you got to replace the rotor I said, man it's got grooves in it a half inch deep like they gonna have to be replaced can you turn them no <laughs> not that bad i saw one at a shop the other day said just started making noise they had gone all the way through the one side material. of the rotor into the center oh. grooves in it. <laughs> yeah. down to where that where the heat dissipates that but just started making noise they got all their money out of them that's what they did, I guess. I mean, if you're going to spend a bunch of money fixing it, might Yeah, well, I mean, you might as well might get your well money's worth of what was on that. Nails. So. Got some new hats. New. There's a few. Oh, look good. Uh, those are some of the flex fit ones. And oh, then nice. I'd gotten in a ton of the other mesh back hats the other day, and I, I'd put a them go quick, don't they? I think it was four sleeves, slap full of different hats I put on here Tuesday after lunch. And I bet I don't have ten hanging up here left. That's good. So it's that's, crazy how quick hats go. That's better than riding around not selling them, you know. There was some piece, somebody that was asking if you had any of those uh, toolbox trays left, and right there's the answer. I see two, one, two, three, two buckets. four, there's five two left. There. There's only five left. So you got five of them. So, did you see your impact in the sockets that you had in that case? I did. There's some guy asking about it too. There's somebody else asked me something else to check on one now, of those on here. I think that's going to be a. I'd have to punch the number back into the computer. I think that's something I'm gonna be able to get. All the time, not just I believe a promo so. deal. Okay. Um, but it's going to be one of those things they're going to have to sell enough of them to keep them. Mm -hmm. So I think I can still get them right now. We'll just have to, you know, they'll just have to play it out to see, you know, if they continue to do well with it to keep it going, I imagine. Well, that's all you can ask. Fair so, enough. Still waiting on those new DeWalt's to come in. Yeah, I'm, them's going to be bad, dude. Were they 450? 400, 450, something like that on 12 volt. That's bad. And it's pretty much the same size as that. It's not going to be much different. Man, that's impressive right there, dude. So. How many of them did you order in? We ordered a slew of them. So. I'm looking for, we need to test one of them. And then uh, we ordered a good bit of the batteries. Uh, the new batteries are coming out with it. It's going to be a 5 amp hour 12 volt battery for them. So. They're going to have them on sale in a kit where it's all together? Or is it? I believe with the kit, you're going to get the 5 amp hour battery with it. Mm -hmm. So, Well. I believe that's the way that we'd order them. I'm going to go test back one of them. Sure. If that little joker would do 450, I'm probably going to buy one of them. Especially as little as that is. Mm -hmm. pretty, pretty impressive. I mean, if our bit driver hit 200, I would think that thing should yeah. be able to get on up to... <laughs> I do too. That one y'all got is so light. Like, man, that thing is. If I did construction work, that's what I'd want right there. Less weight to tote around mm -hmm. in a belt, you know. And Man, you can pretty much do anything you want to do on a home with that little oh, bit driver. Oh, for sure. <laughs> and if you have a flat on your pickup, you can throw a, <laughs> throw a socket on that joker and change the tire. As long as it's torque to spec. <laughs> that's funny. Got a bunch of expert stuff in lately, too, so. Yeah, that whole shelf's full of blue. Tons of stuff. Damn, what is that? That's one of the mechanics time saver carts. That's a big one, ain't it? Well, I, I, I don't know if they call it a box or a cart. That's what I was gonna say. It looks more like a toolbox, not a cart. That's a big but it's, it's not as many drawers as it looks, though, because the bottom drawer is really deep. Yeah, and it looks like and, two, like mm -hmm. the other one did, yeah. Yeah. That's a big old joker, ain't it? It is. Hmm. I like the top the on it. work surface. It's like a heavy-duty Lexan or yeah. something on the top. That's nice. That's a good color, too. 
purple, ain't it? Navy blue, purple. I don't. I don't know what color you would call that, but it's a nice looking. Color. A lot of customers have called it like a purpley color, but yeah, to me it's kind of a navy. It looks good. I like it. So, well. I need to get me one of them new hats. Them jokers right there look good, man. Y'all did a good job on them. You like the flex fits? Yeah. I'm, well, I ain't real picky on the hats. I like flex fits and the mm -hmm. the mesh backs. I don't know if I can wear a small medium, though. It's a different color behind it, too. It's uh, got the maroon logo on it. Oh, I don't want that. <laughs> that right there <laughs> caused me to have the damn flu or something. <laughs> have the flu yeah love make me see it don't need to get sick gotta work my money i grew up a old miss fan tailgated all the football games and then well me and my wife started dating i you started going convert, to, did you? i started going to start a lot and oh um, god all I right enjoy... guys that's all of the video <laughs> today <laughs> <laughs> we uh and I still watch either one of them. You know, I don't really care either way. Oh, my and God. I enjoy Startville's atmosphere more. I, can, I will say really? that. Really? You yeah. like it better than the Grove? It's There's no so, better it's, it's place in the world on a Saturday than Oxford, Mississippi during a football game. So, and I, and I guess it, I may have, you know, spent so much time there. It's just something different, you know. But, mm. I mean, used to. We tailgated mm -hmm. every weekend and did the whole deal. But... And then we ended up actually getting married on campus at the Chapel of Memories in Starkville. At the Golly. state. So. Man. But it, uh, I can't wrong with believe someone say it's a better time on a Saturday in Starkville than it is in Oxford. It's a completely di different atmosphere. You know, it's not to me, it's not even comparing the two together, really. Mm. Mm -mm. It's like it's two completely different things. It is. It's different. <laughs> <laughs> I promise you, it is. So, mm -mm -mm. it won't uh, be long. It'll be that time again. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it, man. And Pro baseball get... starts today, so that's gonna be a good thing. And uh, maybe this year they'll actually be able to have tailgating. Yeah, I hope so. The governor says there will. Our governor says there will. Oh, really? Yep. So I hadn't heard that yet. Yeah, he's an old Miss fan too. Okay. Just in case she was wondering, you know. Yeah. So it's gonna happen in Starkville. I mean, in Oxford. I don't okay. know about you guys in Starkville. They need to put you out, keep you on the ten group <laughs> <laughs> social distancing <laughs> class. <laughs> all right, guys. Well, I got a bunch of work to do. We got an Allison tour part in there and trying to get all that back together. Like always, thanks for watching. If you want one of these tickets right here, go back and watch last week's video. It tells you how to enter. That way you can get the big Titan box for a hundred dollar bill, no taxes and none of that good junk on top of it, just a hundred dollars. And you gotta come move it and haul it away. And it's yours. All right, guys, y'all be careful. Like always, hit the thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise, cool tools, and discount codes. And if you're not subscribed, it's super simple. You take your finger and you press that button. Just click it. That's all you got to do. You guys have a great week. Catch you next time. See ya.